Hey, what's going on YouTube? Today we're going to be fully loading, jailbreaking the Fire Stick. Some people call it jailbreaking, but we're fully loading it. Basically installing third-party third -party apps. So what you want to do, you want to connect to your network and you want to log into your Amazon account. It'll look like this. The first step off the bat, and this works for all Fire Sticks for watching free movies, free sports, pay-per-views, and all that content. Just follow along and you'll have your Fire Stick fully loaded. Okay, so you see this screen here go to this gear icon right here to turn on developer options first and then go to my fire tv or my device when you're there you'll see that i have developer options you may not see this which is fine you want to click on the about button and on here you'll see your device name click seven times one two three four five six seven see it says no need you're already a developer once you click seven times it'll turn on the developer options so when you go back you should have that there. This is the first crucial steps that we must take to fully load your Fire Stick. Once you're done that, press the home button and you'll be back to this menu. Now from here, very simple, go to the find, go down to this box right here. You can use the Alexa voice remote, the blue button, or you can just type it in to the search box. I'm gonna use Alexa, downloader. And I'm gonna search for the downloader application, like this, downloader, okay? Once you find that application, click on it and click to download the little cloud. It's going to queue it and download the downloader application, okay? It's going to install it and we're not going to get into it yet. We, there is a couple of steps that we must do, okay? Don't open it yet. Simply when you install it, just hit the home button, okay? Now the next crucial step we need is to get IPVanish VPN. And the reason I say this, that we need a protection or VPN is because in Downloader, you might not be able to go to our store, to the link to load the apps. It might be blocked by a internet serv service provider, geo-blocked, uh, it might be completely blocked, or you might not be able to connect to it, okay? So to get around that, go to the Find icon and search for an application called IPVanish. So here we are, IPVanish. Just like that, IP Vanish. Search for IP Vanish. It will come up like this. You'll see a white and a green logo here. Click on IP Vanish and then click to download IP Vanish VPN. <clears throat> now you're going to get your own username and password. To get your own username and password, you can scan this barcode somewhere up here with your phone or go to that bit.ly link up here. Also in the pinned comment and description, the link is there for you. Uh, pause the video if you need to get the VPN set up and then we'll go on to the next steps. I'll show you how to set the VPN up, how to get it going. The, the links are all here, how to get it. I teamed up with IPVanish to get you the best discount. It's a few bucks a month. It's a cup of coffee, Starbucks coffee a month, I say. And it keeps you protected on unlimited devices. People ask me about this, how many devices? It's unlimited. You can run IPVanish on unlimited fire sticks, unlimited phones, whatever you like. It's one of the best VPNs and I partner with IPVanish to give you guys the best discount through my links in the pinned comment description or the barcode here that you can scan with your phone for easy access and to set up. Once you have your IPVanish account set up, you'll be able to log in and I'll take you through all the steps. So once you go to these links here, and you go to the website, sign up for your package, get yourself an account, you'll get an email confirmation. Click on that email confirmation to confirm your account. And once you're ready to log in with your email and password, you'll simply open up IPVanish and you'll log in with your username and password. I'm going to log into mine and I'll hit the login button, but it's the same procedure you would do once you have your account from, uh, from the bit.ly links here in the pinned comment description or scanning the barcode here. Let me log into mine and let me show you the quick setup for IPVanish, okay? Okay, once you log into your account, it'll look something like this. What you wanna do is you wanna go to the gear icon. When you log in, connect on Android Startup, okay? You'll see some options here. You don't have to worry about this, okay? There's also a new feature called threat protection that blocks ads, trackers, and malicious websites when the VPN is connected. This might impact some streaming apps. So I don't turn it on, but this is a new feature that you can experiment with. If you're getting too many ads in some of the movie and shows applications, you can try turning that on. It might help. I haven't experimented much with it, but it might prevent them from working. It may not. So give that a try if you'd like, if you're getting too many ads, okay? And once you do that, make sure it's on startup and then go into this location. This is a very important step. Once you're in the location field, okay, scroll all the way to the right side and we're going to select United States. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to favorite the United States, okay? 
And from here, you can click and connect to United States. So click on that and say connect to United States. You should get a pop up like this. You can click OK and this should start connecting you to the United States. This will start going like this and then you'll see it connected to United States and we got a different IP. We're fully connected and fully protected. So that's available. Like I said, the barcode, pin comment in the description, it's going to keep you safe, protected. It's going to be able to get the unlinked store, okay? So let's hit home and let's do the unlinked store now to get the actual apps. So three squares plus one. Remember, we downloaded uh, the downloader application, okay? And we've installed the IPVanish VPN and we connected to a US server for this to work, okay? Click the downloader, open it up, press the allow, press the okay. Click one up here to go into this field here. And then once you're there, type in the following URL, exactly like you see it here. So unlinked, you're going to put in exactly like that, unlinked, OK, dot link. OK, let's put that in exactly like that. So unlinked dot link exactly. Once you put that in, you're going to press the go button. What's going to happen? You're going to go to this website now and you're going to be able to move the D-pad. The website is going to start loading and see how I'm moving the D-pad and then I can press the middle of the D-pad. So you're going to scroll down on the website, on the unlinked website, until you see download APK Android like that. You're going to click the middle of the D-pad, it's going to pop up and it should now with the VPN on and the protection on, it should connect, you should not get an error that it can't connect to it. It's a 3.9 megabytes application and once it's finished downloading, it's going to try to install it, okay? But make sure you have your VPN on if something does not work. Now, when it downloads, you'll get this error. Don't worry, hit settings. See how it jumps now to developer options. Now, install unknown apps, click on that, and make sure in downloader we turn it on. D-pad middle, turn it on. Now, very important step. Click one backward arrow here on your fire stick, the backward button once, and the backward button twice. When you click it twice, it'll throw you back in here. Now, very important step. Now, you have the opportunity to press the install button again. <clears throat> Now this will pop up and from here you can press the install button and we've successfully installed the unlinked application, okay? Now it's very straightforward. We're going to press the open button once we've downloaded, our VPN is on, okay? It's going to come up with this menu. Now here it's going to say new library. We're going to click on new library. Here we're going to click into this blinking field and the code for the unlinked store is fire stick. If this code doesn't work, make sure and double check that your IP vanish is turned on. Okay, if some people are complaining getting errors, this is probably due to your VPN not being turned on, okay? Once you put on Fire Stick, you're going to press that next button right here, okay? Press that next button and it's going to throw you into my store, okay? Make sure now stop whatever you're doing, don't press anything. Read the welcome message, it's going to give you a lot of information, what apps, what uh, things to use, what are the best apps, what I should be using, what should I be installing for movies, TV shows, whatever content you're trying to get. Once you're done that reading the welcome message, okay, you can press the enter button to enter into my store. Once you're into my store, you'll see sections. I'm in the Fire Stick Tools section, but I can scroll up and down and you can see all the other applications. So I'd scroll down, you got the movie section, you scroll down, you got the pay-per-view section, you got the sports section, you got all the sections. But today, for presentation purposes only, we're going to install Task Kill Fire Stick just to show you how to install apps from my store when you scroll up and down to get all the other apps, okay? I got over 50 apps and this is a New Year's update. This is a 2024 update, okay? Click Task Kill Fire Stick or whatever app you're trying to get. You can try this on another app as well. Press the download button. And I want to show you this because this you have to do only once. Once you do it once, you don't have to do it for any other applications. Press the install button and it's going to give you an error. That's what I wanted to show you. You're going to press the OK button. You're going to go back into developer options, install unknown apps again, and then unlinked here. Remember we turned it on for downloader? We're going to do it for unlinked now. We're going to turn that on. We're going to press again, one back, one back and one more back, three times. Now you can see it's installing the fast task killer. It's gonna install it, then we can press the done button. Now, if you wanted to get any other apps, you'd click on that. For example, IP Vanish, you could click download. It would download the IP Vanish VPN, and this time you would not have to turn on the developer options. It would just do it straight off the bat for you, okay? 
I have my VPN on, you can see it's downloading the apps, everything is working. Remember that you can always go back into my Unlinked store and get all the, get the apps updates, the new updates, the players for the apps. I have my store always updated, always the newest apps. You'll find the most comprehensive update in my store, the best apps and always up to date. Okay, some, some stores and some other places are outdated. I'm always up to date, okay? Once you download the app, same process, install the app. And as you can see now, I can just press the install and that would install the app, okay? That's pretty much it. Make sure you scroll up and down to get all the apps and press the home button when you're done. And then when you want the updates for the apps, you hit three squares plus, and then you can go in back into the unlinked store and you can get that. So let's see what we've done. We've in installed the downloader application. We got IPVanish VPN, okay? You can see it's running. It's always connected, okay? Uh, then after we got the IP Vanish VPN, we got the unlinked store. To be able to enter the store, we have we're using IP Vanish. We entered into the store and we installed Task Killer, but you can install any other apps, and they should show up here. And that's how you can load 40 or 50 apps on your Fire Stick. I wouldn't recommend that many because you might run out of memory. But load the best ones. The welcome message in the unlinked store first time you get in tells you that information, okay? So that's pretty much it. We fully load it. If some apps you install from my store don't show up in your app section here on your Fire Stick, if you go in here and they don't show up here, you can also run them from here. Gear icon and you can also go into applications and you can go to manage installed apps and you'll find them all here and you can launch them directly from here if you wanted to, okay? So that's pretty much loading the Fire Stick. Make sure to get all the updates, to always go into my store and get everything that you need. Make sure you run the IP Vanish VPN, always connected. You can scan the barcode here. You can click the link, pin, uh, link in the pin comment or description, or you can go to this bit.ly link to get the best discount, the best deal. Uh, you know, we were anywhere from 50 to 73% off depending on the, uh, of the time of the year. Uh, I think right now we have a good discount running so you can you know, go to this bit link, scan the barcode, pin comment description, get protected, get safe, load your Fire Stick, fully loaded. Uh, you're going to get tons of stuff. All the apps are updated for 2024. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for being here. Much appreciated. Drop a comment below what city and town you represent. Where are you from? Uh, how long you've been doing this? How you found me on YouTube? Uh, you know, how you like these videos? What did I miss? What was I too fast? Was I too slow? Which city and town you're presenting? Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for being here. Very, very, very important for me to be able to keep updating and doing these things, guys. I need you to hit the like button. So if you're here and you want all the newest updates, hit the like button for me because that's going to help me to continue striving and working hard for you guys to give those updates to you. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for being here and I'll see you all in the next video.